everyone! Welcome back to my channel! I'm Jean and I'm so excited to have you guys here for today's video. So for today, we're going to do a pick a card reading about the next change happening and the signs that this change is about to happen or will soon be happening. So, you know, um, I just came, actually just finished filming um, another pick a card uh, reading and the topic was actually a bit heavy and you know for some reason i feel inspired to do this you know quite like quite a light version of a pick a card tarot video and for today we're going to do some live shuffling and it's going to be more like a pick a crystal kind of thing okay so for today we're going to use tarot and then we're also going to use fortune tea leaf cards so tara will talk about the changes happening and then the fortune tea leaf cards will talk about the signs like literally you know um the thing that will be coming in from the tea leaf are just signs that this change is about to happen so without further ado let's go ahead and introduce the piles for today so for pile number one we have fluorite and it has this juicy thing in the middle and then for pile number two we have labradorite with its yellow and blue flashes there you go and then for pile number three we have the moss agate with the white juicy thing around it okay so this is pile number three so um you can pick based on the energy of the crystal so you're free to um pick more than one for this reading and then if you guys are ready let's go ahead and get started with pile number one hi pile number one welcome to your reading so if you have chosen the fluorite crystal this one is for you so we're going to go ahead and find out you know what are the changes that are going to happen Okay, so I'm gonna get um three to five cards. Okay, so we got three. So first one that pop out is strength card. Next we have the five of swords in reverse. And then we have the two of swords. I'm gonna get more cards, like two more. And then next we have the star card followed by oops one more okay this is actually great this is great okay one more about the change oops happening okay now we have the ace of wands so pile number one i am seeing that for the change that is about to happen you are finally going to win a battle that you have been facing for a long time already so we have here the strength card so it's saying that you know in the days to come you are going to finally master up the courage the confidence and the strength to finally face the situation i'm seeing that you are going to finally be prepared to face this battle that has been you know um draining you down has been you know um challenging you for the longest time and with the five of swords being in reverse i am seeing that you know if someone has been betraying you someone has been backstabbing you you know someone is working against you especially um in for the purpose of harming you i am seeing that this person will finally be exposed and you know there's karma happening now karma in a sense that the consequences of his or her actions will finally be you know um returning to him or her and i'm seeing here with the two of swords that you know this time your time will finally come now whatever the situation is again this is more of a general reading but i'm seeing that you will finally stop feeling like an option okay i'm seeing that 
you will finally be prioritized. Okay, you will finally, you know, um, be in charge of a particular situation and you are finally going to pursue this thing, this decision that you have always wanted to pers- pers- um, pursue or push through. Like this time, nothing and no one is going to stop you or inhibit you. I am also seeing that for some of you, this could be a family situation. Like, you know, um, you most likely will finally be able to free yourself from an abusive or from a toxic home situation. For some of you, I am seeing that, you know, um, you may be wanting to file for divorce or it could be that you're wanting to change homes because, you know, you want to move out of your parents' house or from your um, significant other's home in order to find a better place or, you know, experience a better um, home life. The star card, I'm seeing that, you know, the star will finally be aligned and will soon be favorable for you. So hope is on the horizon. You know, good things, the things that you've been wishing for, waiting for, hoping for, they will finally come. You will finally be saved from this um, stressful, horrible situation that you are facing in. And then the Ace of Wands, I'm seeing new beginnings. And new beginnings in terms of big things, small things, everyday living. So, you know, there's a complete um, wonderful change happening for you. Now, let's get more information about the signs. Okay, One of, what, what are the signs that, you know, this thing in your life oh, is going to happen? We have here January. So, I'm filming this and will be posting this in August. So, you know, January is a significant month for you. And then we also have 10th. So, Tent is also a sign, temporary situation. Okay, so yes, most likely with the home. Okay, so let's get okay another month. You also got another month. So, oh August. Okay, so again, I'm filming this in August, but again, this is a timeless video. So whether you are near January or August on while watching this, you know these are significant months that will be helpful for you um, in terms of this positive change happening in your life and then we also have caterpillar so caterpillar is also a sign now this could also talk about butterfly but also caterpillar is talking about you know the transition or the phase that you go through towards your journey to become a butterfly or your met or you know towards your metamorphosis now, the message here in the card says things will not always be this way. A change is coming. So, see with the Ace of Wands. So, really beautiful changes are happening for you, pile number one. Let's get um, a few more information. Okay. Let's get, you know, two more cards for your Fortune Thief cards. What are other signs that are about to happen for pile number one? You have here, okay, compliments from an admirer. Okay, so, you know, one of the signs that this change is um, going to happen is that you know, you'll be soon receiving bouquet of flowers or could be bouquet of chocolates, you know, but a bouquet, like a beautiful bouquet to your liking, something that you'd most probably definitely enjoy. And then one more sign of this change happening for you. Okay, so you got two. We have here younger woman. Okay, so you know a younger woman is going to be significant through this transition, through this change. I'm seeing that this younger woman will be helping you out, you know, um towards this new beginning that is about to happen. And then lastly for the last side we have heart. Love, deep affection and caring. So the last sign is heart. So it could be that you may be seeing um hearts whenever you go um or it could be that you know you are feeling more love so once you start to feel more love in your heart you know once you feel like you're receiving lots of love this is one of those positive signs that this beautiful change is about to happen in your life 
and that is it for us file number one so i hope you liked this reading i hope this was able to help thank you guys so much for watching and hopefully i get to see you on the next video bye bye hi file number two welcome to your reading if you have chosen the labrador right this one is for you so we're going to do you know the live shuffling first so i'm gonna get three to five parts to see what is this change that is bound or you know going to happen in your life so you have here three of pentacles in reverse Oops, sorry okay and then next cards you have six of swords and then you also have the queen of pentacles you have the queen of swords and let's get one more card for us to go with your reading positive change like a lovely change pile number two okay one more oh there you go and then you have the king of wands so a lot of court cards happening okay so pile number two i am seeing that for the change that is going to happen in your life you are most definitely i know i'm um, sorry you're most definitely going to experience a positive change in your career okay with the three of pentacles being in the first i am seeing you leave a toxic or bad job something that is not serving you well something that you feel might be a dead end in your career i'm also seeing that you know you are going to leave this job that you know in a way takes advantage of you or does not appreciate you and also you are going to leave this boss or this colleague who takes the credit from the work that you do or you know in general just does it acknowledges your part in this work and then you have your six of swords is what i'm seeing now this is about moving out i'm seeing that for most of you the job the new job that you're going to take maybe from somewhere outside your town or outside your um country it can even be an out of country opportunity now um the main energy here is that you will be you will be given an opportunity to work outside of your comfort zone so this is actually a great experience you know and i'm seeing a lot of excitement and possibly a lot of travel involved with your new job and then we have here the queen of pentacles and the queen of swords so in this new job i'm seeing that you know you are going to experience um, a lot or going to rather receive great pay great benefits um great hours so basically this job offer that is about to come to you is an offer that you cannot resist okay and for some of you i'm also seeing that if you are not looking for a job okay um you may be you know i'm sorry this may be about progress in terms of the business that you're all um opening or you're planning to do or projects so let's say for instance i you don't want to go to work but you know you're thinking of putting up a business or going to into freelancing regardless of the case um there's a strong earth energy surrounding your eating so i'm seeing that you know um whether it's employment whether it's about business self-employment or freelancing investments you know there is a wonderful opportunity happening for you and this opportunity is something that you have been waiting for um something that you have been preparing for um or you know looking forward to have and i'm seeing that this is something that will definitely let you get a head start on your project or on your passion or let's say for instance um you've always been one thing or looking forward to handling a team because you know that you have it in you to lead or you know be a great manager so i'm seeing that this new career opportunity that you will have you know it will be given to you you will have the opportunity to lead to create a project or handle people and i'm also seeing here with the queen of swords that you are going to kill it in this new work like you know you're going to really crush it you're going to be really great you're um going to um really excel okay be good at it and you're also going to get the recognition that you deserve so 
anything i'm seeing here with the queen of swords that anything that you were looking forward to you were hoping to experience in your previous job you will definitely experience it in your new job you will be given that opportunity and then king of wands i am also seeing here that you know there's also going to be promotion um in your new work okay so if you're not looking into promotion i'm also seeing that you know let's say for instance you want to be transferred to another work um you want to learn other you know another set of skills so that will also be given to you you will also have that opportunity in this new work now let's see what are the signs okay that this change is going to come to you so just give me a few moments file number um two and then for the month you have here october and then you have here nest okay an emotionally secure loving family supported to you so one of the signs that this change is about to happen is when you see a bird's nest or a nest in general so i know that's very random <laughs> But it's also very interesting at the same time. Okay, so let's get a few more, um, you know, fortune TV cards. Oops, to give us more info on the change. And we have here, oh, we also got that. Like, pile number one also got that. Temporary situation. So, this may be something outdoors. Like, there's this and then there's tent. Okay. Let's get, like, you know let's get three more let's get as many signs as we can so this is a great opportunity i'm so happy for you pile number two that you are going to experience it soon next okay so this is definitely something that you deserve and then another sign is die oh my gosh diamonds see like abundance like abundance is really happening soon for you this is the next change that is bound to happen for you pile number two okay you have your diamonds you'll be receiving or receiving or rather giving a precious gift okay so there are gifts involved in here now diamonds could mean actual diamonds or it could also mean you know all my crystals or things that sparkle like jewelry okay so let's get here for the month you also have february okay so i'm filming this by and posting this by august so you know whether you're closer to february or october okay so those months are significant for you and then let's get oh, okay let's get one more sign for you to watch out for you know that this beautiful change is about to happen you have flag okay oh my gosh flag okay remember when we talk about you guys going to a different country so like this is really it okay you really kind of get this opportunity of a lifetime kind of thing like it's, sorry like it's really marvelous it's really exciting it's really big flag okay do not be tempted to lower your standards see do not be tempted to lower your standards you are going to get the job offer of your lifetime pile number two and it's gonna be great marvelous wonder and full amazing cannot um emphasize on it more okay so yeah that's it for us pile number two i hope you like this reading i hope this was able to help thank you guys so much for watching and hopefully i get to see you on the next video bye bye hi pile number three welcome to your eating so if you've chosen the moss agate crystal this one is for you so as promised we're going to do a live shuffling of the tarot cards first to see you know what is a wonderful positive change that is bound to happen for you soon so i'm gonna get five cards for us to know more about this okay oh my gosh pile number three you have the six of wands for your first card wow okay next card you have the empress okay next you have the page of wands then you have the high priestess wow okay okay like one more like i'm going to target getting a particular um 
let's say like suit okay hold on oh my gosh and it came knight of cups all right so pile number three what i'm seeing with the change the positive wonderful change that is about to happen soon for you is that you know um there's going to be success in terms of family in terms of love or romantic relationships basically success in relationships so six of wands is saying that you know pretty soon the first sign of or rather the first thing that will be changing within you is self-love so you're finally going to accept you know um the good great things about you the things that you did well the accomplishments that you've had in the past the great things that you are bound to do that you will soon be doing you know the promising um character that you are and i'm also seeing here acceptance um even with the flaws like you know these flaws that you have you do not see them as circumstances or things that will you know that will hold you down but rather these are things that will lead to your success so i'm seeing self-love the first thing that will happen is self-love and then we have your empress so i'm seeing that for some of you if you are trying to conceive if you're trying to um you know yeah trying to conceive or get pregnant this is a positive message that it will soon be happening for you or if you're not um trying to conceive basically empress card here is saying that you know you will soon experience a better um you know a better love or a better um quality of relationships so it could be that you know let's say you've had an argument with your mother it will soon be you know patch up it will soon rec um be reconciled now i'm also seeing here that you know if you are looking for you know um companion so six of wands besides the empress is saying that you know someone will soon come into your life and make you feel less lonely now it could be a friend it could be a lover but definitely soon there will be someone coming in to your life who will be you know um a great addition who will bring so much fun page of wands okay so much fun so much laughter and i'm also seeing that you know it's easy to communicate with this person like literally you can just talk about anything and everything under the sun and there's no judgment at all like it can be you know the deepest talks you know talks topics deeper than the universe to something as shallow as your favorite pizza flavor and either way it's gonna be fun it's gonna be exciting so everything is light and easy and soothing all at the same time with this new person the high priestess is saying that pretty soon there will be okay there will be some confessions coming in so it could be that you know um there's going to be mutual affection happening between the two of you or it could also be that you know this person or someone may be um telling you important positive news that will also make you happy that will also uplift your spirits because we have here the knight of cups so i am seeing positive progress you know positive things happening in your relationship things moving forward in a great direction so let's say for instance if you're single i'm seeing that you know you will soon enter into a relationship or let's say if you're already in a relationship i am seeing that you know um the level of intimacy or commitment that you have with each other will be progressing to the next level so it could be you guys moving in together living in together it or it could be you getting engaged or um finally getting married okay so either way there are positive a lot of positive changes happening for um you know for your relationship now as promised we'll go ahead and get the signs so um according to the T fortune cards what are signs to look out for that these changes are happening and the first thing that you have is april this talks about the month of april so i am filming this by august and will be posting this in august so you know april could be significant but i'm gonna get one more month you know to see which one is closer 
Okay, so one more sign. So it could be a month or it could be like literally just a sign. Oops, okay, and you saw it. You have tank card. Celebration, fun, enjoyment, okay? So I'm not sure if I even pronounced it correctly. I'm so sorry, but I'm seeing here cup. And most probably this pertains to, you know, um a party. Okay. A party or a gathering or a celebration, you know, something that's really fun. So that's one of the signs. You most probably might be meeting this person in a party. Or, you know, things you already might know this sorry. My cry is cracking cracking up. You might already know this person. And, you know, things will get really interesting and exciting at a party. So, let's get one more sign for you, pile number three. And then we have, well, <laughs> well, we have, well, family wishes coming through. So, you know, well, I'm seeing that for you guys, it doesn't uh, literally have to be a well, or, although it could be, you know, depending on where you live. But it could also be, let's say, a decor, like a furniture or a miniature well. Something that looks kind of like a well. It could be that. Or it could be um, also be a fountain. Um, whether it's a public fountain or, you know, a fountain found inside the hole. Like that mini fountain kind of thing. So something that brings water. Okay, so that's also a sign. Okay. Or it could be this thing. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> like shot glass also brings water, right? Okay, so let's get more signs for you guys. Okay, so broken ring. Parting of face. Okay. The broken ring. Okay, this one's interesting. So you might be seeing a broken ring. Or I'm also feeling, you know, a broken circular thing. Weirdly enough, I'm seeing or hearing broken clocks. Like literally just clocks, broken clocks. Or like anything broken, circular that's broken. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna get one more month for you guys. Okay. Okay, then we have grasshopper. So, grasshopper could also be a sign for you guys. And now, it doesn't have to be, you know, like a living life grasshopper. It could be like just a toy or, you know, just a miniature kind of grasshopper. Okay, and for the month, you guys got July. Okay, so again whichever is closer but it could also be both like april and july could both be significant months for you guys and that is it for us pile number three so i hope you like this reading i hope this was able to help thank you guys so much for watching and hopefully i get to see you on the next video bye bye